Hello guys and girls, welcome to another video. Today we have Defender CD60 SCE on Mahogany. Let's go! It has an all mahogany construction, so it is a mahogany top, solid mahogany top, it is mahogany back and sides laminated, mahogany neck and the fretboard is walnut. The edge of the fretboard are rolled for a more comfortable access. It has a 12 inch radius, small vintage frets, it has a Fishman preamp uh, with a piezo and a tuner and quarter sewn scalloped X bracing. So this guitar is around the 300 to 400 uh, euros, it depends on where you get it. So now let's check how it sounds and then we'll come to the conclusion. So, it has a very mid-range sound to it, I like the fact that it sounds, I don't want to say um, small, but it sounds compressed, so I'm used to my Yamaha FG740, which is uh, spruce top and um, maple back and sides, and so it has um, a totally different sound to this uh, mahogany guitar. I dig this, it's, um, it's warm, 
uh, it has character. I really do. I really like the neck. I think the neck is the highlight of the guitar because the the, the side, the shape of it, uh, it's it's like a C, not too shallow, not too big. The width of the nut is 43 millimeters, and the uh, scale length is a little shorter than usual uh, Fender scale, so it's 643 millimeters instead of uh, 645, and it makes it easier to play. So, um, as far as the uh, pickup is okay, nothing special, but I mean, good pickups can cost as much as the guitar, so I think it's a bonus if it has that it has it. But the other, the other thing is, I think out of the box it's pretty okay, but I will, I will totally give it a setup from a good from a luthier because the frets are a little sharp, so um, they are. They are done good in the lower part of the fretboard, but up here they are a little sharp, around, so they, they need to be rounded a bit. And they are also not the shiniest frets, um, so when I, when I use some vibrato, you can hear the frets buzzing. But it's, it's fixable, you just need to polish them, and then the guitar is gonna be perfect. The nut is not bone, so I would probably swap that, uh, but it sounds good and ke it keeps in tune. The tuners are uh, the standard Fender tuners that you find on most of the uh, sub-500 instruments. Um, I don't know, they work, so do I recommend it? Yes, I think it's a great choice if you want to a different um, sound than the, than the usual recipe. Personally, I prefer the mahogany uh, pair with uh, spruce top, but it's my personal preference. My friend really fell in love with this guitar as soon as he picked it up, so uh, it's really a, a personal preference. But uh, this new Fender series, I think it's it's done well. It's uh, pretty affordable, so if you if you're looking for a guitar and you don't want to share a lot of money on it, uh, consider this one. It's a pretty nice one. This is it for today, guys. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think about it, and I'll catch you in the next video. See ya!